What's up, Mavericks? This is Erica Seppala, writer and editor here at Merchant Maverick. Today, I'm going to walk you through how to set up your Square online store from start to finish. Whether you're a small business owner or just getting started selling online, Square makes it really easy to get your store set up in just a few steps. So let's dive in. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to either want to sign up for a Square account or log into your existing account at squareup.com. Once you're logged in and set up, you're going to go over to this left menu and you're going to click on online. You're going to see the top option is online store and we're going to click that. Once we click that, you're going to see this little introduction that talks about Square Stores. Um, you can go in here and you can view the pricing. There are paid options, but you can get started for free. So we're going to simply click start your site. So the next screen you're going to see, you are going to choose how your customers get their orders. If you ship your products, if they can pick up in your store, or if you have an in-house delivery program, you can just simply check off any option that you offer. There's also an option that none of these apply to me, but we're going to just uncheck pickup and say that we only ship our products. Then we're going to go to the top right corner. We're going to click continue. The next page is telling more about your business. You need to add in your phone number and your business address. Once you do that, you're going to click continue, but we're just going to skip this step for now. Once we finish with that screen, it's just going to be a second while the store is being built. So the next screen is going to give you an offer to try Square Online Plus free for 14 days. After that, it's $32 a month. You can scroll down and see what you get with the Plus plan. You can also click on See All Plans. We're going to stick with the free plan, but if you want to upgrade to get these additional features, this is where you would do that. So now we are on the Square Online Overview page, and Square makes it really easy to make sure you do everything. As you can see right here on the screen, it says you're five steps away from being able to start selling online, and it gives you a little checklist so you can go through everything. So we're going to start from the bottom. Our subscription, we have the free monthly. You could click here if you do want to upgrade. Um, we're going to go back up to the top, um, customize your site, which we will go to that in just a minute. Shipping, we've already set up shipping for the most part, but let's click on that. You can set up your shipping details here, um, where it's going to ship from, your phone number, an optional email. You could fill in all of that information to get shipping set up. For my account, I have to verify my identity, but since this is a test account that I just used to do these looms, um, I'm not going to go through that. But if you're not verified, you will need to go through the steps of that. We'll also set up our domain, but we can do that, I believe, when we customize our site. So let's get started with that. So we're going to go to customize our site. Over on the side, you're going to see a lot of options. You can click on site design um, to change colors, fonts, site elements, things like that. You can update your header. You can update your main banner. You can add featured items. So this would be anything that you really um, want to put out there and showcase. We'll just go on here. We actually don't have any items at the moment, but you could go in there and select items if you wanted a custom selection. Um, you could also do most popular, recently viewed, any things like that. You can click on here and you can edit your footer. Um, you can add a logo, subscription titles, social icons, things like that, and update footer branding. You can also add a section if you want. Once you have went in and customized everything, you can go on here and you can click preview. It gives you the preview for um, customers that are looking on their phone as well as the desktop view. So you can look at that, see what your customers are seeing, and go in there and update that as you want. Now, one thing that I will say is that when you're on the free plan, you are stuck with this template. If you do upgrade, there are various other templates that you can use to really customize the look of your store. But you're kind of stuck with this, although there are the customization options, as you saw on the free plan. Once we have made sure that our site looks the way we want it to, we're going to go up here to the top right and we're going to click on publish. So 
once we do that, we're going to have to set up our domain so you can find a custom domain if you are on a paid plan. If you own a domain, you can also put that in here. Again, you'll need to be on a paid plan in order to be able to do that. On the free plan, you will be able to use a square domain. Um, there's already one set here for us. If we want to go in here and edit this, we can do that. Once we have it what we want it to be, we're going to click on change. And you can see our site has been published. And as you can see, this is our site. Now there's nothing on here. I didn't have any items or anything like that. You're just going to look a little different. You can have your items on there, your pictures, your descriptions, your pricing and things like that. But I just wanted to run through this really quickly and just show you how to get this rolling. But that's it. You're officially set up your Square Online store. And from here, you can start selling right away, add new products, and even sync online orders with your Square POS. If you found this helpful, make sure to check out our full Square review over on Merchant Maverick for an in-depth breakdown of features, pricing, and pros and cons. Thank you for watching Mavericks, and good luck with your new online store.